of our pigging videos. This time we're going to talk about steel body pigs or mandrel pigs as they're called and then our uh, three little pigs, we call them steelies. And these come in all sorts of sizes, a little two inch bite eye. Uh, the most common of the steel pigs for us here is, is uh, what we call an MD, a multi-disc and standard it comes with two guides and four sealing discs. That's one and two at each end, and the reason it's called a bi-die can actually go through the pipe on one way, and then you return and turn the pressure back, and it goes back. You don't need to uh, extract it and turn it around at either end. Um, the beauty of the um, steel body pigs, as you can see, big, robust body, uh, lasts forever. Uh, and you've got then the uh, consumables, if you like, the ceiling and guide discs that are easily replaced. So the body is clearly the expensive part, and then you can just replace and, and order additional discs as you need to. So quite a contrast, two inch, 24 inch. So that, as I said, is a very good big part of our um, sales, that's another four inch I'm guessing, uh, and it also comes, it can be used as a gauging pig, uh, where you'd remove one of the ceiling discs and, and put in a uh, gauge plate, uh, which is sold separately and made specifically to order, depending on, on the client's requirements for the idea of the pipe. So there's another one. And then um, another aspect of, of um, steel body pigs is, is brush pigs, and we carry a range of those as well. Uh, the little WWB, which is up to six inch, uh, and then you can actually take the same style of um, bite eye, multi-disc, and add brushes to it. Uh, and believe me, these brushes aren't to be messed with. So that's the same configuration as these, it, with this, the guide at either end, two ceiling discs, a brush in the middle, uh, and obviously it's doing the same job as the um, bite eye, but with the added benefit of the brushes. Um, then the, the bigger lines, we have both the SRB and the ARP um, brush pigs, and um, the other thing you can do with any of these is add magnets. The benefit of the magnets is as the brush breaks the um, lining or the rust or whatever your build up is, the magnets grab it and these things are pretty powerful magnets. Let me see if I can break one away. So they can be added on. Again, they're different bodies for the standard bite eye, so you can't interchange. So if you're needing magnets, Let's do that again. So you can see there's some strength in the magnets. I talked about gauge plates earlier. There's a range and we can make these to suit whatever diameter, how many slots and everything that you might need. We have a fairly standard and small size is only three mil and the uh, eight inch and up that we go to a six mil. Um, Obviously, full range of both guide and ceiling discs available. We keep them on the shelf. And, and the, the other thing that is obvious from the ones on display, the smaller sizes have a single shaft and the bigger ones have the full body. So the discs for the full body are obviously just large circles, brushes, spare brushes. As I said, you don't mess with them. As well as the standard um, disc pigs, you can also get a um, conical cup pig. The benefit of the conical, puck, the conical cup pig is that it will compress, the cups will compress down 15%. So if you've got a line that's got, um, not dual diameter so much, but just some indents or whatever, the conical cup pig is more likely to get through than a standard disc pig. So again, spare um, cups on, on the shelf.